Hey, while you in the first five seconds of the video, go ahead, like and subscribe. Or said, drive that nonsense from among, from among you. Get that out your neighborhood. They got to go. Let the drug dealers know y'all got to go. Let the people know that's on heroin, crack, pills, weed, because that's a drug too. Cigarettes is a drug too, because it kills your body. It got to go. Come closer, my brother with the dreads, my brother with the gray shirt, my brother right here, uh, my young people right here. All right, I'm Yeki Yell. I got a question for y'all. Let me ask every last one of y'all a question. Is drugs a problem in our community? Yes, yes, right? Drugs is a problem. We all live around here in this area, right? We don't live, the people you see in purple, we don't live too far away from here. So we can agree that drugs is a problem in our community. Let's Give me Deuteronomy 18 and 10. Because if that's an issue, if y'all see that as an issue, just like we do, what do we need to do about it? Bring it out. Because if we live in a community and we got issues in our community, we should be doing something about it to get rid of those issues. Right. Drugs is plague in our community. Yeah, we can talk about Murder all day, that's an issue. Uh, prostitution is an issue. Single parent households, yeah, that's an issue. But look around. I want everybody to look around real quick. What do y'all see going on right now? Drugs, right? Our people are on drugs. And that got to stop. That's actually a sin. God actually told us to beware of drug dealing and drug usage usage and what to do if that come to if that comes our way any of y'all familiar with the bible you believe in the bible you believe in the bible did you know god told you how to deal with drug dealers and drug usage that's actually in the bible you got what i want this is the book of hold on hold on call it and read it this is the book of deuteronomy chapter 18 and verse 10 there shall not be found any among you, any one that maketh his son or his daughter pass it through the fire, or that useth divination, or an observer of times, or an enchanter, or a witch. Hold on, I'm going to have the brother read it again because we read a lot. This is actually a commandment. The same thing as thou shall not kill, thou shall not steal, thou shall not commit adultery. This is the same thing. Read. There shall not Read with power, let's go. There shall not be found any among you, anyone that maketh his son or his daughter pass it through the fire. So it said, There shall not be found among us the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. You know how people got issues with each other and they say, I don't want to see you on my side of town. God saying the same thing, it shouldn't be nobody found among us that maketh our son or daughter pass through the fire. Antoine. My brother, what's your name with the gray shirt? You said Antoine. Antoine. Antoine, do you know what that's going into? That's going into abortion. Don't we have a lot of abortions in our community? Don't you see Planned Parenthood on every corner, dang near on every corner in the black community in Chicago? That's us. God said that shouldn't be found amongst us. Y'all know how they got that song that uh, F nigga free or whatever? Y'all know they got one called Baby Daddy Free? They remixed it. It's bad out here. Read. Or that uses divination, or an observer of times, or an enchanter, or a witch. Read that again. Or an enchanter, or a witch. It says, or an enchanter, or a witch. My brother with the dreads, what's your name? Sean, do you know what an enchanter is? 
Do you know what an enchanter is? Do you know what an enchanter is? Y'all know what a witch is, right? What about you, Antoine? Like, witchcraft, witchcraft, right? Casting yeah. spells, yeah. making potions. You remember that old ludicrous song, I Got That Potion? Yeah. What was he talking about? He was talking about drugs. He was talking about drugs. Drug usage is with witchcraft. Selling drugs is witchcraft. Using drugs is witchcraft. We are not supposed to use drugs. Y'all hear me? We're not supposed to sell it. Read. Or an enchanter or a witch. Read. Or a charmer or a consulter with familiar spirits. Or a wizard or a necromancer. Read. For all that do these things. So hold on. God said that they shouldn't be found amongst us. Now he's going to say what to do with them. Read. Unto the Lord. And because of these abominations. Hold on, read that again. Verse 12. Verse 12. For all that do these things are an abomination unto the Lord. So our people committing uh, uh, abortions, selling drugs, using drugs. Uh, it also mentioned... Um, observer at times, and observer at times is people that's into horoscopes. They like the uh, what's what's hold on, how how old are you? You don't mind me asking. Forty four. So I'm thirty three. What's the old school line when you go in the club? What's your sign? Uh, my name's such and such, and I'm in the court. No, we're not supposed to be observing that. We're not supposed to be observing that. All right. Observer at times is horoscopes. We ain't got no signs. Those, those, uh, that's pagan. Y'all hear me? Read. And because of these abominations, the Lord thy God doth drive them out from before thee. So the Lord said, drive that nonsense from, am from among you. Get that out your neighborhood. They got to go. Let the drug dealers know y'all got to go. Yes, Let the people know that's on heroin, crack, pills, weed, because that's a drug too. Cigarettes is a drug too, because it kills your body. It got to go. You can't, hey, you can't go to Jewtown and see them slanging drugs on the corner, can you? You go, you go deep, you know where Skokie at, right? Skokie ain't too far from here. You can't, hey, you can't do none of that there. You said where? You, do you see drug, what, so, so if you can't do that over, over there to people that's not your people, why do it to your own people? Why do it to your own people? We got to see ourselves better than that. Antoine, did you know we are gods according to the Bible? We are gods. Let's get that in Psalms. We are gods according to the Bible. A God is not supposed to do drugs. A God is not supposed to sell drugs. A God is not supposed to sell drugs to his own people. Do you agree? He ain't supposed to sell them at all, but make it even worse, we sell them to our own people. That it... That is one of the biggest downfalls of our community. You, you, uh, it's promoted everywhere. Uh, it's promoted in politics because they legalize weed and marijuana, right? Uh, you seen what Joe Biden did? Y'all seen what he did? He, uh, he was giving out uh, heroin products to combat racism. Sis, how did, what's your name, sis? Jay. Jay. Okay, do that make sense to combat racism, to give out needles and pipes? And nah, nah, but the next person that get into office is going to do the same thing. Legalizing marijuana, how does that help the black community? This new law that they got passing where they uh, drug-induced homicides, where J.P. Prichner is legalizing, how is that helping the black community? We gods, we are gods, we. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 82 and verse 6. I have said, ye are God. Read that again, Antoine, uh, sister, my brother, what's your name again? Lawrence, I need y'all to listen up. My brother with the red hat. 
My brother with the red hat. Finish the scripture. And all of you are children of the Most High. So the Lord told us that we are gods and children of the Most High. We about to close out because it's raining. Our people, we must stop selling drugs and stop using them. Because we are gods and children of the Most High. But if we don't stop, destruction is going to hit up all of us. Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. Nation is unity. Nation is you. Oh, you know